What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video by me, Athena. LGK Pop since 1998. And Orbits, guess what? I am going on my Luna journey more. I know I've seen a lot of Luna stuff, but I'm into their whole subunit-ish stuff now and the steps that created Luna. So that brings me to Luna One Third's song called Rain 51 DB. I remember a lot of y'all Orbits um, explaining what that means in the comment section of my previous Luna reaction. But I'm gonna focus on what I see here and then go back to that, uh, those comments and then put two and two together. From what I remember of Luna One Third's work, they're always um, more towards like the whole 90s K-pop feels, which I just absolutely love because that's when I started my love for K-pop in the late 90s, so. And then after watching that one, I'm gonna move on to Chweddy's Love Cherry Motion MV. At first, I thought the, the video was called Love Chweddy Motion, but I'm sure that works just as fine. Anyways, yeah, I'm going to stop talking and continue my Luna journey of discovering the stuff. So on to Luna One Third's Rain 51 DB MV. Quick pause. If y'all been enjoying the things that I've been doing here on my YouTube, please hit the thumbs up button. That gives me a good idea on what y'all like and what y'all kind of like. Feel free to also subscribe and turn on the notification bell to stay super updated with some new things. All right, let's get it. Straight up 90s, look at this VHS shit. I remember those- Oh! Ooh, preview! Hustle! Yes! I swear I am doing karaoke in 1996 right now with this edit. Like, that reminds me of like an LCD. And the subtitle of this bear. Oh yay! Okay, and this the bright close-ups, not late K-pop nineties. for this and I love that the lyrics are so highlighting on just that loyal wholesome love that you feel towards someone in the late 90s it was very in to sing songs about super love or super heartbreak they always stay with the 90s concept they stay with the concept that they intend <laughs> I love Hasla's voice. I'm so happy she's back. Ooh, yeah, I hit a little harmony. 
This is so... I feel like a teenager again. Oh gosh, and the end of the video, the, exactly the same when he started. Like a full circle kind of thing. Man, I, I felt very nostalgic. Like, if you are familiar with a uh, Korean group called Jeki, Jetskis, there's different ways to say their names. And I think even translated as Six Crystals or something. They have a song called Couple, and it's a very classic K-pop song. I'm, I'm hoping you'll see y'all heard that song. And it brought me back to those days. My favorite member in Jeki was Go Chi Young, and he's not a part of the group anymore. So um, it made me feel like just that teenager, you know, Go Chi Young, you know, he's my crush. And just hearing the song every time I come home after school in my boombox, and just swing, this really brought me back. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and move on to Chuede's music video. See what her solo of Love Trade Motion is all about. So here we go. I actually don't know too much about Chuede yet, like individually, so it's just the right time. Oh, it has like that classic edit of how Luna videos look like. Ooh. Oh, this song is funky. Okay, she has this really pretty voice. Okay, her color must be purple, which is my favorite color. <gasps> Okay, this is so innocent. Uh, oh, her purple dress! Cute. Aww. Oh, the dance. What in the F just happened? So, whoa, 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 hmm. So in the beginning, it's all very innocent, saying, I don't know what love is, A to Z, and it's all very bouncy and cute. And after she ate her cherry, reminiscent to like, I don't mean to say anything like disrespectful by this, but like the meaning of like popping the cherry kind of thing, that, that couldn't, that's just figuratively speaking. So I like that after she eats the cherry, things like turned different. It, it uh, had a plot twist there, Let, let's see. A story starting to okay. Okay, she like fell into the bed and this happens. <gasps> I love this. This is so cool. Cause here in these scenes, the bright scene, she's portrayed as a very innocent, curious, and when she's dreaming, sleeping after she eats a cherry, she goes on like a different experience because of her curiosity when she's awake. This is so cool. Ah, this little dance! Never felt this way before. Goes with the concept. They're like summoning her or something. Hey! So Kim Lip's color is red and Jin Souls is blue and red and blue is purple. Wow! Oh my god, they are color theorying my ass. And I love her uh, 90s like top. 
cute and fresh. Our summer night into the purple dreams. I want that as a sign. All of Luna's videos so like just beautifully shot with such strong concepts. And here we go again. Yes. This is a very interesting change up. Oh, they're there. Why did she been this long? I notice. Oh, and she's. Okay, this is what's up. I love the change up. Ooh, Ooh she's going off. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. She, oh, damn. This is so cool. I even hear this little harmony for the luxury motion. Wow! Oh, wow, so there was like the mirror concepts on the floor, then like there's a moon and now there's a reflection. Oof! Man, I'm telling you, Luna's videos always just have me very mind blown with how far they go with their concept and I don't realize it until later when it like seeps into my brain like the whole you know red plus blue equals purple came through like halfway and just blew my mind and i can't believe i didn't notice them in a video until later it's just because there is so much for my eye to focus on there's concept there's visuals there's lyrics there's paying attention to her voice Twitty has a very strong and soft voice at the same time whatever songs have like drastic beat drops or changes or whatever i always like that even if there's like no concept for it but when there is concept for it like this where she you know eats a cherry and things change up or that's like her dreams whenever it changes up that has concept to it and it's not just a random drop and it sounds good you know there's concept and it sounds good so damn all right i like how i checked out this like innocent 90s jackie reminding kind of song and went into this uh, how is the rest of their stuff gonna be like? And by the way, I know y'all Orbits are super excited for the comeback like I am. Probably even more because a lot of y'all have been with them since these videos were like freshly released. I'm just so excited, especially the fact that Hassel is back with them to like be super complete. So <sighs> we are in for a ride next week, y'all. All right, guys. Well, thank y'all so much for checking out this video here with me on my YouTube. I hope y'all have a great day and until the next one coming up, 